Please, don't get up. This isn't what it looks like. Really? Well, what does it look like, child? Danny? Of course, it's what it looks like, Sherry. My wife's not an idiot. Well, thank you, darling. It's the nicest thing you've said to me all year. Here, let me help you. You know, you really shouldn't wear this color. It makes you look like a tramp. What am I saying? You are a tramp. My One and Only is a nice little slice of 1950s nostalgia. It stars Renee Zellweger as a New York City socialite who comes home early one day only to discover her husband in bed with another woman. But there are no tears for this one. She just tosses some clothes into a suitcase, cleans out the safety deposit box, grabs the kids out of prep school, and heads out on a grand adventure in the cushy comfort of a coupe de ville. Well, how much is the car we want? It's uh, 3,500, ma'am. Give it to the nice man, George. It's not how you do it, Bob. It's not how you do what? Your son means that you offer me less than that, and then we bargain. All right. $1,000. <laughs> this is so much fun. What? It's a little low, Mom. Offer me, say, $2,500. All right, then. $2,500. No. She's absolutely convinced that with her looks and her charm and her class, she can quickly find a replacement for the ex, a big band leader played by a very smooth Kevin Bacon. The period of time really suits Renee Zellweger well. She looks great in the blonde bob and the tightly tailored suits. The kids are pretty terrific too, particularly Logan Lerman, who plays George, a 15-year-old who is hard at work on his cynicism. Accelerate, darling. Put the pedal to the metal, George. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What did you just do? I was checking the rearview mirror. Oh, never, never look in the rearview mirror, darling. George, by the way, and actually the story itself, is loosely based on some of the early memories of actor George Hamilton. So it's particularly rich when George tells his mother that he's heading back to New York City, definitely, because he can't take all the sun in California. My One and Only is like one of those small summer films that blows in every year, like a cool breeze. So if you want some relief from the big blockbusters, consider going along for this ride. This is Betsy Sharkey with the Los Angeles Times.